What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. This is EJ Joyful Plans and I am coming at you with the Christmas release from Amber at Planny Thing. Planny Thing is a Netherlands based shop. Amber is our girl out there doing the thing in the planner community with sticker books, washi, and some journals. And Amber sent these over to me for review and to flip through and share with you guys so that you could get a little sneaky peek of what is dropping at her shop. So I did receive these from Amber and I do have a discount code for you. So Joyful10 will save you 10% off at Planny Thing and I will include my affiliate link down in the description box. Okay, so I know that Christmas has come early, but it always comes early in the planner community because planners got a plan for the holiday season as early as possible. So this releases on Sunday, October 1st. I will put the information down in the description box. Always just look in the description box. You can also leave a comment if you're, um, if you've got lingering questions. So let's get to it. We have washi tape, two sticker books, and yay, an A5 dot grid disc bound journal. Yes, yes, yes. Let's Start, let's start with the washi and the journal. We'll do the sticker books last per the use. So um, I, washi tape is so hard for me to swatch on camera. It just takes too much time. So I sat in the living room with Esther <laughs> and, and unwrapped these just so I could have some time with her while, while still kind of doing my social media job. So we unwrapped these and I went ahead and swatched them for you. We have seven new Christmas washi. I love the way that she's done these. You can buy these individually, but I really like the way that they look as a set. So here is the first three in this really true uh, candy cane red. And I love that we have two different grid options. They're like inverted, like grid, and then, I don't know, the inverted grid, and then stripes, okay? True red there, in my opinion. And then we have a beautiful, when I first opened these, it was kind of dark in the room and I thought that they were almost black, but they are a nice wintry, maybe hunter green. Same thing, you have your grid, your inverted grid, and then your stripes. Also apologize for not having my nails done for you. I feel naked, I'm naked. So yeah, we've got the green. And then the seventh washi is striped washi that's got the green the red, a cream color, and a blue. And so I went ahead and swatched all of them up here, up close and personal, so you can see the red, the green, and then that um, multicolored one. And then I wanted to play around with what they would look like together, kind of mixed and matched. I really love, if I'm gonna use washi, I really like doing it in at least a set of two, but really three is my favorite. But I went ahead and did two of a kind so you could see how these kind of mix and match and they just look fun it's almost like a it's like vintage or like classic americana christmas if i can say it that way um this is very much like vintage a vintage color palette for christmas so these are the washi tape they are available for sale individually but i like seeing them kind of as these look like sets to me but you can, you can purchase, purchase them individually if you want to. Okay, so for me, look, it's always going to be about dot grid journals. It just, it, I have a thing, you guys. I have a thing, it's a thing, it's for real. So let me first, before we look at this, let's talk about this Autumn Days one. If it's still available, y'all should grab it. So this uh, came out in the last, the fall release from Planning Thing, and I freaked out in my unboxing video because it is very rare, very rare, you guys, to find a dot grid disc bound journal in an A5 size. You can find it in half letter, you can find of course the mini, classic, letter size, but the A5 specifically, uh, you typically see with planners and notebooks like on rings or uh, like a binder system. And it's not often that you see it on a disc bound uh, planner or notebook. So when this came out with like my favorite color for discs, I got really excited. The paper quality is to die for. And I said, gosh, I really hope that she does them every season. Well, autumn days, we are currently in, but let's get prepared for the holiday season with this one, bright red discs. And it says happy holidays down at the bottom with a nice winter scene your winter scene on the back and it is the same 
quality, excellent quality, thick, bright white paper dot grid on the discs, A5 size. And I really like the, the inside of the cover. Like so much so, I would maybe even just reverse it and do this. I mean, it's super, it's super cute. So you could flip them around if you wanted to and have that be your cover. I'm not a big Santa person, so I probably would that just because I would do that just because Santa's on the front. But I mean, that's gorgeous. So I love this. I will, of course, tell everybody, get yourself a dot grid A5 journal. It's just, it's just so nice. The paper's nice and it's got a nice thick plastic cover that is super, super sturdy. So we have the washi tape. We have the A5 holiday uh, disbound dot grid journal. You know what she should do? She could probably sell the covers and discs and then people could like interchange them, you know? Although now I want to have like a full collection. I want spring and summer now. Amber, I want spring and summer, please. And thank you. Okay, let's talk about the sticker books, the holiday sticker books. We have Wonderful Christmas Time and Christmas Houses and Trees Part 2. Let's start with the Christmas Houses and Trees Part 2 to the second one 498 stickers 30 sticker sheets i love having the um, deco on the back it's so cute so festive i wonder if i have within reachable distance um part one christmas one because y'all know y'all know i like to compare and contrast um i'll see if i can find it but let's let's get through the sticker book first so we are starting out and remember this is christmas houses and trees and these are just great for setting scenes in your planner. I just love doing that. So this is the first sheet. It is clear deco stickers. And these are just little neighborhood houses in a blanket of snow. Let me make sure. I feel like y'all can get a little bit closer. So I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. There we go. Sorry. We're moving the camera. All right. Here is our first sheet. And our second, so we have two sheets of those. Yes, this is it, you guys. I love seeing the individual houses and then individual trees so you can kind of create your own scene. And these can easily be tacked on to these winter scenes. So, you know, put this, put this down in a corner and then throw a couple trees and a house kind of a little bit up to the upper right corner. And you've got like yourself a little village. It's just too cute. So we have two sheets of those. I just love the individual elements. Now we're getting into like, I don't know, maybe Christmas or not Christmas, um, Santa's um, uh, like work. Oh my goodness, you guys, where is, <laughs> is the North Pole? I was going to say Santa's work place, Santa's work area. No, but it's kind of like the North Pole. So we've got uh, Nick's. Nick's Fritz Cafe, Santa, Christmas chair, no, Christmas choir, I can't read, trinkets, gingerbread man, hot chocolate, that was cute, two sheets of those, I promise I can read you guys, <laughs> and then we have, this is slightly different neighborhood, houses are slightly different, these are all brick houses, Again, we have more individual elements. These are fun. We've got um, a bench and like a brick wall so you could kind of set up a little um, fencing around a house. Ooh, this is cute. Some string lights here. These are all individual elements that you can add to your planner. Two sheets of those. I can't believe I was going to say Santa's workplace. <laughs> well, I did say Santa's workplace. All right, now we have functional boxes. I just love this. I love having the variety of shapes and the circles. I don't write on these, but they look really cool, kind of spreckled about my planner, my notebook, and that's going to be really fun to play with. We get two sheets of those, and I must point out... These are the same colors as the washi. Hold on, let me grab this. So, see that? See how they're coordinated? This washi with your functional stuff. <gasps> Cute! It's like a whole thing, you guys. It's a whole thing. Very well thought out and designed by Amber. 
Okay, so now we've got a different neighborhood with a pink house. That's cute. A little fox in the snow, and deer, and mama. Two sheets of those. Christmas trees, and just trees out in the wild. Very pretty. This scene is very pretty. Two sheets of those. I go through tree stickers so fast, so I love when there are duplicate sheets of trees. This is our second colorway with their boxes. Ooh, now we're getting into gingerbread houses. That's fun. Literally gingerbread houses full of candy and icing. Two sheets of those. Ooh, gosh, I mean like where is she getting these images? They're so pretty. This is our next style of houses. that I can't flip the page on. Oh, so pretty. Ooh, these are shops. So on one page, you could have your, um, your houses in this style. And then on the other page, you could line these up and create a whole like storefront street with these houses, or not houses, these buildings. And then we have our functional boxes and circles with the new colorway. Oh, so pretty. Yeah, this is very, I don't know, Colorado to me. I love it. Kind of more of a barn style house. <gasps> trees, all the trees. Give me all the trees. I love it. And it's really cool that some of these have Christmas lights and some of them don't. So if you're creating a scene where it's outside, obviously you wouldn't put Christmas trees on it with lights. But if you wanna have uh, Christmas trees out in the wild, you've got these snow ones and then these other ones, actually that one has lights on it, but these other ones that don't have lights, which I think is really nice. So you can do an outdoor or an indoor scene. We have our functional boxes for that set. So that is, Christmas Houses and Trees Part 2, all of the scenes being made in this sticker book. And I love that there are corresponding boxes that go with it. So cool. Okay, let's take a look at Wonderful Christmas Time. I think a lot of people are going to like this sticker book. If scenes are not your deal, I bet Wonderful Christmas Time will be. Let's take a look at this one. Oh my gosh, there's dogs. <laughs> you cannot go wrong with puppies. This is so cute. People are obsessed with corgis. I, they're adorable, but um, that's just funny. Like every sticker, it's a corgi. So cute. I love that we've got like this kind of cozy, cozy living room scene here. Two sheets of those. We've got indoor Christmas cheese. Some of them potted two sheets of those. These are all clear. And that's true for the first sticker book. All of the deco stickers are clear. And then of course the functional boxes are on paper. <gasps> Cute. Oh my gosh. This is going to be very fun. We have ornaments and then we have some wreaths. Y'all know I'm going to be stringing some ornaments in my planner. Look at that. So cute. I wonder if some of these could pass for fall colors to where I could do it now. I'd love to do a fall ornament spread. <gasps> Might have to happen. Here are our functional boxes by way of ornaments. I love these. We've seen these before from Amber and I feel like they're like the number one sheet to go. You use them up every season. So it's good to see these back. Then we have our functional boxes. Two sheets of those. Now we're getting into more kind of traditional Santa stickers. It's <laughs> pretty funny. A line of his clothes, Santa suit. That looks like a Pez dispenser. Snowman Pe Pez dis dispenser? Is that what that is? Very happy and bright. Now we get into Santa, good old jolly Saint Nick. Two sheets of those. Very like vintage 
colors. I really like the vintage colors of it. And then we have our uh, living room scenes and our front door, just really cute. This sticker right here, the detail in it. So you could easily take um, like full standing Santa, Santa and you could throw him like in this living room. That's what's so great about sticker books like this is when they have individual elements, you can cluster them however you want. Ooh, now we've got sweet treats, all the sweet treats. Get a cavity just looking at them. We have functional boxes that match. And then we get our next kind of colorway and design. And these are, this is like a kid Christmas. That's cute. Got this little girl with her little earmuffs. So sweet. Cozied up with some hot chocolate marshmallows. Oh, little girl and her dog down here. Very cute. Two sheets of those. I could see this being a really great set of stickers for memory keeping if you've got young kids because it is very playful. Playful and sweet. These are all clear. Then we have sheets of presents, which would be fun to kind of cluster together underneath one of those Christmas trees. And then we have our boxes to match. What? This is unexpected. She's given us some clear sheets that have quotes and words on them in a really fun, whimsical font. I'm very happy with this. So there's two sheets of these that are exactly the same. December, the number 25, ho, 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 Santa Claus, dinner, Christmas Eve, tree, Christmas, happy holidays, family time, Christmas, single, single bells, jingle bells. You guys, I don't know. Have I told you this? <coughs> it's nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock, so I'm a little tired. Family time, decorating, joy, snow, Merry Christmas, holly jolly, and holidays. And there's two sheets of those. Fun! So you've got a variety of different styles of Christmas in this sticker book. Mostly secular, um, secular Christmas, snow-capped Christmas, and um, love the ornaments. I think of all the of all the sheets, I think um, this one I'm super pumped to use. I don't know, it's just calling to me. We'll see. You'll have to stay tuned to see how I use it. All right, friends. So that is it from Plan Anything. Plan Anything. We've got the Christmas Houses and Trees Part 2. And then Wonderful Christmas Time. The Washi Tape. And, of course, the beautiful A5 Notebook. Again, these all release on Sunday, October 1st. I will leave the information in the description box. Make sure you use Joyful10 at checkout and uh, shop my affiliate. If you have any questions, leave them down below. Come hang out with me over on Instagram. My handle is ejjoyful underscore plans. It is always a good time. And if you want to hang out with me again, I sure hope that you do. Please consider subscribing to my channel. I am going to go to bed. So God bless you. God bless you and keep you. Have a good night, friends. I don't know when you're watching this, but I'm going to bed. God bless you and keep you. Do something creative today or go to sleep and I'll see you in my next video.